A werewolf can be killed only with a silver bullet or a silver knife or a stick with a silver handle. I'll tell you something that I found out. A werewolf can kill a vampire, do you know that? I never knew that, so I don't want to be a vampire anymore. I want to be a werewolf. You're insane. What's up, everybody? Major Retired Richard Jet here, and in a campaign speech on Wednesday, the GOP anti-abortion candidate for Senate from Georgia, Herschel Walker, made the statement, I don't want to be a vampire anymore. I want to be a werewolf. This video has been circulating all over social media, and it's embarrassing. But even more footage of other rambling speeches has surfaced, too. Remember, during a debate with Senator Warnock, Walker decided to brandish what he claimed was a police badge. How many times must this guy be the laughing stock of the country before his supporters see through it? Probably never. We have to remember that these are Trumpsters and they will follow Donald Trump off of a bridge if he jumps. Herschel Walker supporters are the same people who support Marge the Trainwreck Green and her gazpacho police, her space lasers and lies about January the 6th. This is where Herschel Walker fits in. He fits in with the lunatics, the bottom feeders, and general overall jack o -lines. Maybe Marge wants him to be chief of her gazpacho police if he's not too busy, you know, being a werewolf in London. In McDonough, Georgia is where Walker's probably drunken speech took place. He went on about a vampire film. Then he started mumbling about a character who pulled out a cross and holy water against a vampire without the expected effect. Walker said this showed that life don't even work unless you've got faith. We gotta have faith. Sorry, Herschel, but faith doesn't cover stupidity and you're as bad as they come. We all know that his opponent is a man of faith. Senator Warnock was a pastor at Ebenezer Baptist Church, formerly home to the civil rights leader Martin Luther King. Senator Warnock is a man of integrity who tells the truth. He is respected by the community that he represents and is a leader in the Senate, a complete opposite of what Walker represents. Folks, Herschel Walker is a bumbling moron who has no place in politics. He is a washed up football player who is trying to grift his way to the Senate. Let's send him and his mangy morals packing. Sappers clear the way, airborne all the way.